సో ఉగ్రంలో మీనా ఏం చేస్తున్నారు ఎట్లాంటి కష్టాలు పడుతున్నారు మూవీలా నో ఇట్ వాస్ యాక్చువల్లీ గుడ్ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ ఇట్ వాస్ ఛాలెంజింగ్ ఆల్సో బికాస్ దెర్ ఆర్ లాడ్ ఆఫ్ ఇండియన్స్ ఇమోషన్స్ అండ్ ఐ గెట్ టు డూ స్టన్స్ ఐ గెట్ టు డూ యునో ఫైట్ విత్ దిస్ విలన్ టీమ్ అండ్ ఆల్ ఇట్ వాస్ సచ్ అన్ ఇండియన్స్ బట్ ఐ దట్ ద ద వే నో దే పోట్రీ ద వే దే రోట్ అండ్ ఆల్ ఇట్ వాస్ అ గుడ్ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ ఫర్ మీ ఐ థింక్ this was really challenging i think the audience can see it in the screen super yeah. so big brother nunchi uh, it all started in 2020 yes. big, big brother nunchi ippudu varaku and we are uh, uh, super excited to see yes. you in jailer also enno kotta vishayalu jarugutunnai yes so how did uh, you transform into this me uh, history ekkada ekkadu nunchi start ayindi all the career <laughs> yeah i am basically an it developer so mm-hmm. i did my engineering then directly to it so i was working the regular IT job. Like, it was a night shift. So, but I never felt any happiness. Happiness and I was an artistic person. Mm. Always, still. So, I write, you know, I sing, I dance, I travel, I do a lot of crafts. But I couldn't find anything there related to what I am doing that time. So, then I want, I want to shift. I want to do a drastic change to my life. I was waiting. Because from my childhood, I always want to, I dreamt to be an artist. so i was waiting for the right time opportunity then it happened one day i just switched my career path all of a sudden to cinema and it was amazing just really that that decision that one second decision i'm feeling so happy about that so every day it's a process i'm enjoying the process one project to another project one character to another character one place to another place one director to another director so feel like i'm doing something very soulful so yeah so you did your engineering right yes uh is there a proof an engineer will do anything in the world other than engineering <laughs> so exactly. am i exactly oh uh, yeah yes. uh, cheers to that and uh, i'm a mechanical engineer here i am uh, talking on the radio so from the moment uh, big brother i know proof yes first day camera mundu lights camera action and you have your uh, dialogue being told uh, on air yes etlu nind i mean on screen i experience etlu nind is amazing uh it it's a dialogue uh, it's a very emotional crying very sentimental dialogue so it was very nice feeling and i i did it in one shot and i was not expecting that <laughs> i was not expecting that i always have this habit of preparing before i go to the set before i prepare the camera i'll prepare myself and i always make, make sure that i'll not you know make any difficulties for the others time and also the one shot the director was so happy and i felt like oh my god finally he's he's happy because you know I, that's a, that's a debut True. so i was i was very new to the industry i don't know anything but i felt very happy about it so uh, you mentioned about your writing yes uh, what what is it all about jo- what's the genre journals that just journals just scribblings whatever i feel if it's like hard soft happy anything i'll just scribble it so i feel like you know it's raining the words it's come to the paper again you will feel empty so to make myself empty i'll run super uh, are people who are watching yes. are having they are having a long long week day so if you were to make them feel better is there a one line or one one phrase that that touches your heart and th- that you wanted to put it out yeah so i i like this quote very much it's not mine okay but no guts no glory adi <laughs> no guts no glory uh, whether it is monday tuesday wednesday come to office don't yes. say monday blues <laughs> tuesday blues <laughs> So no, actually you face your challenges and you see the life is very beautiful but you get to face that it's true yeah then you know after you know where big climb you see a beautiful you know visuals that the scenery so like that life is like that so always take your guts always take it on you you'll, you'll see the glory super so <clears throat> as far as we have known and seen and enjoyed malayalam film industry makes yes. one of the most the best movies all the time all throughout the years so uh, what is the favorite movie of yours in malayalam film industry uh, malayalam the list is big but recent time lo <coughs> i like kumbling nights okay yeah, i Nights. really like the movie because that's my you know again and again watching in the list i like uh, kumbling nights i like uh, nayat there are lot of movies if you see the old movies i am a very great fan of priyadarshan sir's movies so so i mean i have a thousand movies in my list because my little movies are always special super yeah. uh, especially when we talk about uh, priyadarshan sir her daughter uh, kalyani priyadarshini has yes. uh, launched herself and uh, 
made herself in the industry yes. so gracefully and uh, people love her so much yes. and she came uh, when she came the movie which she was uh, featured in the first movie that had little expectations so is yours yes. uh, nandi being the first movie of these two people uh, yes. uh, naresh garu and uh, the director they have outperformed the whole uh, this thing yes. and it is being redirected in hindi as well and we heard those those news and all yes. so does the expectation put you in the spot or do you take it as a new challenge no it's a new challenge i was so happy that i'm going to be part of a you know very proven big team so that is also a challenge for an artist and you, know, you should be equally giving the inputs to them you you should perform you should be very responsible for that because they already you yeah, know yeah. in the winning win win team so i was so nervous i was so happy because i have to perform opposite to uh, narisha because he is a very hard working person he put his entire effort there so that was a challenge and good experience also so i was extremely happy that i got that abarna i got ukram so uh, aparna being a peculiar character yeah. uh, in the whole movie and uh, he, they have been having uh, family struggles and she is yes. there as a mother so is is there anything that you take out from the movie aparna's character into real life yeah she'll do any in she'll go to any extent you know protect her family protect her love and she's very patient she waits for things for so long long very patiently she'll understand so for every human there'll be a last moment of breakdown so till then she'll be like very patiently waiting for her family things to happen she's a very beautiful soul wonderful so going ahead i i wanted to know uh, alar narish garu yeah. he had two two eras uh, the, every now and then he used to make yes. serious movies as well yes. but the word allari in telugu means uh, mazaka uh, uh, funny, funny yes so it all came from a movie called allari yes with that from that he had a total transformation yes. uh, if you have seen him in comedy movies he is so funny and all yes. of a sudden he has the serious character yes. how was he on sets he was he was very serious he is very serious he's like he's always in the character because he is a very you know brisk <laughs> the police very responsible police officer i never saw him you know laughing making fun or nothing he's always he is always like the character in the character in the character yeah so i'll i'll introduce you to <laughs> his part in the other version he yeah. was lean he was funny i think i mean uh, uh, all i'm trying to say is he blended into the character so much that he is yes. always a police officer yes. all through at the time he fit fit for the character like 110 percent i think he worked so much for the character and I mean, director had lot of, you know, he need a particular look, he need a particular transformation, and he did everything for the character. I think that's a teamwork end of sure. the day. They both believe in themselves, and that's a you know big thing for me also. When I am doing this is the initial project in my career, so I feel like I'm also setting my foot here with some good, wonderful, warm welcome. <laughs> yeah. So uh, talking about uh, blending in as a Malu girl in Telugu film industry. the uh, blending into that how was it how was it is it was it challenging no only the language is difference people are so nice yeah yeah so uh, telugu film industry welcomed you so well so well i am so happy maybe because of my producers they like very warm you know very very good people so especially my entire team also they like very hard working people they they just work 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 and all and we have a very good you know rapo between all of us so i feel like i am still in malayalam tamil that same vibe same vibe i think it's strange so right? i've i've heard from naresh garu they had you guys had a really long uh, shooting time yes. what was the most uh, the, the lengthiest uh, time that you spent in the sets and 48 hours continuous <laughs> no <laughs> no break no food <laughs> no sleep <laughs> nothing we got like 45 minutes to take a shower we took the shower came back that's all oh my goodness <laughs> So how yeah. uh, how much time did you relax after that? A one day break. I one day break. One that's day. it. One day day off. I slept in the day. Then again night shoot. So in a little bit uh, Malayalam. Uh, yeah. Did you feel like uh, I'm in a great place, or you were like, "I'm not even there." Am I right? No, I'm not. I'm not even there. I'm not. Okay. No, this is nice. This place is really nice, and this place I am dreaming for so long. This this is my dream place. The industry, the camera. I mean, the interviews, the people, the media. So I feel like this every day is a good day for me. Super. Yeah. The point of view of a Malu girl who is aspiring to be an actress uh, into Telugu film industry. How yeah. was it? Amazing. I've got 
much better what I can actually expected that it will be really struggle first film language people I am new but nothing happened like that everybody were like come come we are one of us <laughs> that I got that vibe so it was so, nice so well we have been to kerala and we have uh, enjoyed puttu we have in like fish curry yeah. all of that palamburi palamburi <laughs> exactly uh, still we find places where we get uh, palamburi in yes. hyderabad we go there we e- eat it and next all next time you, are, you 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 invite me also i want to taste the palamburi hyderabad i'll palamburi. get it for you <laughs> wherever you you are i'll find it i'll get it for you and that 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 is my assurance so how how did hyderabad welcome you with the food with the uh, i am foody yeah. i love food i i minimum take five meals a day <laughs> <laughs> seriously i am a pakka foody person i eat only rice okay seriously and this is not for Come chuma on. i'm saying L- look at my personality she <laughs> eats five five times a day i eat okay six times a day but still <laughs> i work out <laughs> you work out okay okay cut 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 <laughs> Just kidding. I seriously eat five times. Eh? Five meals is preferable. Uh, that's a healthy food. Yeah. Right, I, I eat only rice. Five mm-hmm. times right with mm-hmm. chicken. So I'll, I'll take, because I'm doing martial arts, parkour, dance classes, horse riding. So I have certain training sessions. So I need more carbs. I need more energy. So that's why I eat rice with a lot of protein. So I eat a lot of fruits, juices. It's like my entire day you know it's always thing no okay this is 11 o'clock i have to eat something it's 2 o'clock i have to eat something this for okay your brain is yes. scanned i mean yes. uh, designed that way so did you try to try to i mean try out uh, hyderabadi biryani yeah, biryani i am i am a great fan of biryani here i eat hyderabadi biryani when bangalore i eat donnai biryani in chennai talapakatti biryani kerala talasheri biryani oh my goodness look at it <laughs> <laughs> so like how was it how was the first taste of very nice very nice food even our producers they own their own hotel uh, military hotel so they are ama- they are amazing food they sometimes they used to send food so locations amazing food they send me some pickles and all wow. so when we talk about food i think we need two more days two more days i know 48 hours of shoot 48 hours of hours of uh, recording of yeah. this so again uh, coming back to the movie we have two beautiful songs one is peppy it is taking yes, all cool cool uh, family yes. time and the other one deveri, deveri. which is uh, sung by anurag kulkarni and composed by sri chugaru yes. brilliant composition yes. so how do you like the songs oh my god especially a music director he is like i think he is an energy bomb but the background score I, I know, I know. Uh, the within the trailer, like, no, it is giving. I think you only need vocals. Yeah. You don't need any instruments. <laughs> he himself an instrument. I think he is a you know, essential part of a movie. He is a backbone. Like uh, my director, he is like a backbone of a movie. Without his music and background score, I don't know. It's an incomplete project. So I am so happy that he is on board. He did it, and again, he was from the set. You know, true, I am the new true. one only. Uh-huh. So it's amazing. I love the songs. So I my favorite is Devery. Devery, yeah. so is mine. So is mine. Yes. So, <coughs> uh, working in the industry, uh, especially in this movie, the police officer, him, uh, Alar Narish Garu, being the police officer, he had a lot of. I mean, within the trial, uh, trailer, there are a lot of so many action uh, sequences, the mm-hmm. jumps and all of that. Mm-hmm. As a cop, it requires all of that. Yes. So, did you have to cover? a better half of him in in the action part <laughs> yeah i actually got to do some stunts the real uh, we have some accidents traumas and all we all we didn't do used any do we made no cgs nothing we did it ourselves super yeah. so uh, marina in the movie yeah i mean marina as in you in real life and the actress yes. what are the similarities or what what percentage of you is her uh in abarna you are yeah. asking very less very less percentage you are calm peaceful no, and so is she no i am very talkative i am very talkative oh, okay she is calm and composed she is calm composed uh, very you know very caring lovable um, touchy touchy person but <laughs> i always want shiva shiva's circle her family i am more of an independent person i like travels i don't i don't like to stuck in one place no if my rice if i take an example i'll be here in hyderabad 10 days i'll go to chennai 10 days then 10 days i'll be in kochi okay so the, the, I, the proper proper travel yes, i i have only this constant changes <laughs> so her life is totally he's going to be totally eccentric she's very settled uh, somewhere but i i like more exposure i can't be somewhere for so long i'll get bored so i i like to travel i like to see new places i like to meet new places radio city 